Hey guys, this is Letty. Oh, it's daytime. <laughs> um, I just this is a really really fast video. Um, en route to work, <laughs> so I'm have to be super duper quick. Um, I am going on a. I, I'm I'm transitioning to becoming a vegan. Now, I've been researching the vegan lifestyle for over a year. It's been a long time. And a lot of times I think we are afraid to make transitions, even though they're good for us, good for our bodies and mind, soul. And we were afraid of the backlash from others. I think as adults that never changes from being a child you know child have the peer pressure we have adult peer pressure that we definitely do because we're afraid of what the, you know our people gonna think but we have to you know I, I'm so used to being I've always been like a, a lone wolf type of thing and you know it's always been people just never under have ever understood me so you know i'm not used to i'm not i i don't care you know at this point i'm really numb to it because it's about how i feel and um i've been experimenting with different types of um vegan dishes and recipes and you know i i, I had a hard the hardest time really is i love eggs i'm gonna tell you oh my goodness I'm not that much of a meat eater. You know, I can give up meat. The, the hardest thing about veganism is the eggs. I do love eggs. And I've, I've been I've been trying to find a substitute for eggs. I do, um, I, I, I've kind of, you know, messed around with um, tofu. Tofu is very versatile. I was really impressed. I was like, wow. You know, you can just make so many different dishes with tofu. And, you know, I got some and my husband, he's thinking about maybe transitioning and I'm glad that, that we both we're going to it's it's hard to do something and everyone else in the house, you know, cuz my children are you know, they're not going to be I have 18-year-old, she's not going to do vegan. However, mostly all of us drink almond milk and I, I you know I, I don't drink cow's milk anymore i totally I'm done with cow's milk I drink almond milk we've been drinking almond milk for two years now so it's like it's been a slow process but now I'm really this year I'm really tr trying to really weed everything out and just eat vegan um I like the way I feel I don't know what it is about certain foods that make you a little bit more antsy. I don't know if it's the chemicals. I don't know certain foods. I don't know if it's extra sugar or what have you. You know, I feel balanced. I've always had issues with my skin. I'm hoping that living or eating more healthier foods um, will improve my skin. My, I've always had skin issues. I don't know if it's, it might be related to diet. I don't know. Um, I've just always had, you know, I've gotten, you know, a lot of blemishes and things like that. And, uh, you know, it's, it's just, I, I'm hoping that a change will come, but definitely, um, I'm going to tell you what I had yesterday. I had, uh, yesterday evening for dinner, I made, um, I saw this awesome video this woman made crab cakes, um, you know, vegan crab cakes, um, out of hearts of palm, and she used um, chickpeas. <laughs> it was so good that I almost, I was like, oh my gosh, you know, this is so good. This is sort of similar to crab cakes. I mean the real the real crab cakes and I really I was so I loved it so so much it was so good and I just had vegetables on the side um I was I felt so energized you know I had so much energy oh my god the sun is blazing yeah it was really really good it was 
really, really delicious. And, um, you know, I there's a lot of dishes that I've made that vegan I love. I love, um, I've made vegan fried chicken with the gluten flour and, you know, just made the dough and then fried it. Um, I make this wrap where I only put in, I, it's a wheat tortilla. I mean, I think the wheat tortilla is vegan. I'm looking at labels, you know, when you're vegan, you got to watch the labels because they'll sneak something in there. So I'm, I think that they are vegan. I'm not sure. I have to check the label, but basically it's a wrap and I cook the wrap uh, in a little grapeseed oil and then I put in spinach and whatever you can you know wrap is whatever you put in there you know tortilla is you can just throw anything in there um i put a little vegan meat in there it's um the uh, morning star grillers or something uh i throw some meat in there i throw a little vegan cheese in there uh and i love them they're they're really quick lunch i'm gonna do a uh, i'm gonna do a video on that um that recipe that's a really quick and easy recipe you can just do anything with. Um, I love vegan butter. I, I only cook with vegan butter now, you know, and, and it's, it's, it's just so delicious. Vegan mayonnaise. Honestly, everybody in my house eats the vegan mayonnaise. They don't eat the regular mayonnaise. The regular mayonnaise is still in there, but it's like, it's a slow process. It's been a while, and it's just gonna take some time because I don't expect to you know, it be it's gonna take some time because it's such a. I'm so used to a certain thing. I've been eating meat as long as I can remember. You know, I grew up on meat, so I'm not a meat eater. The problem really with me is giving up the eggs. The eggs are the problem. But I found a really cool tofu scramble recipe and some um, vegan bacon. This person made out of rice paper. I am so impressed with all the options because you can pretty much, and the thing about, oh, you gotta eat this and that. Veganism is just about not harming animals in the process of preparing your food. That's all. Anything can be veganized. Spaghetti can be veganized. Um, any dish can be veganized. You know, it's not, you're not limited. You just, you're basically, you're cleaning up the ingredients that you use regularly. You know, um, I made some, some, some pancakes, not pancake, waffles. Um, someone did some chicken and they used mushrooms and a, and a batter that they made, you know, so, um, they made their own version of buttermilk and I am just so impressed with all these people and I'm a, I'm actually going to name a couple of them that have influenced me the most give them a shout out and their channels are awesome if you're thinking about going vegan check them out because they have really inspired me and I've made a lot of their dishes and they are delicious um uh sweet potato soul is one the vegan zombie love them funny um who else um raw fully raw christina i'm not going i'm not going raw vegan but i have used i've made some of her recipes and they're excellent and um i like a uh, mind over matter the uh, alicia i love her she actually does she does some vegan she she will veganize um her dishes so um anyway guys this is really quick i got a roll and um you guys just let one let you know what was happening and if you have any tips or comments or questions let me know and you know we can learn from each other so um until next time talk to you later bye bye